first things first, I just wanted to thank you guys so much. You guys were so freaking supportive on the last video. Um, not the Jean haul, but you guys were very supportive on that one as well. But the um, I'll be deleting this video one. Thank you so much. Man, you guys reached 1.5K likes. Like, holy... that That's a lot. That's a lot. Let me, but I'll just that's say... Enough. But that's love. I feel loved. Thank you for the love, guys. <laughs> but I thought I would uh, put this in there. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. You guys really know how to bring someone's spirits up and get them re-motivated again. Um, and also a little update. Week and a half now. I've been cutting. I feel leaner. I'm feeling quite good in the midsection area. Um, I don't know if it's visible to people, but I feel it. Um, that's usually what I tell clients. You're probably going to feel it before anyone sees it. That's how I feel right With now. With the lemon water. Holy my goodness, that lemon water, I tell you. I've been going to the bathroom like six times a day. I can't handle it anymore. <laughs> I was like, no more lemon water for me. I gotta put that stuff away. Uh, I mean, it's good, it's really good for you, but whew, I'm telling you, <laughs> I'm gonna retire <laughs> for some time. <laughs> this is a little too much information. It's making you drink. It is making me drink. I'm drinking way more, which is good. I have noticed a lot of benefits from drinking more. My skin feels softer. It feels very nice. My cellulite has improved dramatically, which I already knew that because dehydration makes your cellulite look worse. Another update, we are in the 50s today, so the weather is being really awesome. Yesterday we went to the playground. If you follow me on Instagram, you saw I was playing around, got stuck in a tire. Lost my balance on some beams. It was fun, fun times. Um, but the weather is getting better, which means garage door gets to be opened. I feel more motivated to work out because the garage is, isn't like freezing. So bumping up activity is a lot easier. However, I think because of the extra activity, I'm not recovering as fast anymore. So my leg days are kind of being jeopardized. Yesterday was supposed to be leg day. I moved it to today just to get an extra day rest because my lifts were getting weaker. And I just, I was still sore going into my leg day. And I'm like, you can't really push it. It's getting me mad. Um, so I decided to rest yesterday. Um, well, I, I rest meaning I did a little bit of cardio and abs. <laughs> um, and then today I was going to do leg day and kill it, hopefully. Let's go kill it. So as you can see from my last leg day, I was getting weak. I got stuck and it stayed down there. <laughs> By the way, since you guys are always asking now even more so about everything I wear, I'm going to start telling you guys. Forever 21, fair warning, I bought it like last year. So the chance of actually finding this sports bra may be a little bit difficult. The pants, however, I bought yesterday. They're Reeboks and they were from Meyer. I've been calling it Meyers. They don't have an S. They do have an S. They don't have an S. What? I've been saying Meyers this whole time. <laughs> I just added an S to it. It's Meyer. Yeah, <laughs> I'm happy you're surprised too. I just figured this out. It's news to me. No one told me. You guys are so good at crafting me all the time. So I'm like, I'm saying it right. Anyways, let's resume to my leg day. <laughs>
gonna throw on fives. Last time I told you guys I accidentally threw on a 10, and that was a huge jump, that was 20 pounds more. This is only 10 pounds more. So 235, here I come. I'm gonna clear it. Now, the tens. I didn't clear it last time, but I'm feeling good today. first and then I'll get excited <laughs> all right so I cleared it I'm super stoked but he's gonna record it again uh, from a lower angle for you know those people who are gonna try to justify by all means so yeah we're gonna do it again It's two and a half pounds. Um, I just want to get my body ready for the next heavy lift. So if I don't clear it, it's not that big of a deal, but I have to, I want to feel the weight on me. So it's five, five pounds. Five pounds more. Yeah, and I am getting tired because as I get tired, I don't go as low. Uh, the first, first set, I went really low, and then the second set, it kind of went moderate. Like I hit parallel, but I didn't go a little bit lower, which I would have liked. So that just kind of happens when you get fatigued and tired. But we're going to do this whether I go down or not, just to feel a little bit more weight on my shoulders. clear 245 is super excited about that I kind of want to laugh at myself because five pounds more and I could not like no if you hear me too during the rep I don't know if you heard me but I was like really <laughs> just like I couldn't get any lower like what the hell but it's okay because that's just gonna be my new goal I have a new challenge now 250 that is my challenge <laughs>
I most definitely got leaner. I must go eat. Anyways, it's time to go eat, refuel, awesome leg day, heavy lifts. Overall, fantastic. I am feeling a little bit leaner right now, but like I said, I feel it. I don't know if you guys see it. I feel like my back looks more shredded, right? <laughs> Thanks, camera guy. Anyways, let's go eat. It is the next day. I actually got a shoulder workout in. I might have a nice pump going on. But seriously, you guys have been smashing that like button. Um, it's showing in my back end that the likes have increased for the month dramatically. So thank you guys. Your support is, oh my goodness, wow. So, so amazing. I can't thank you guys enough. Keep it up, please. All right, so for today's Monday recipe, it's going to be chicken alfredo. Um, the ingredients you need is obviously chicken. We like using a green pepper and a red pepper. I found this kind to taste the best um, you can really use any pasta you want this is his Ooh. favorite he doesn't like wheat uh, I don't blame him he thinks it's heavier and more bland but it's just because yeah. he's accustomed to this one um, you can always do like a brown rice one or a whole wheat one whatever you want we're gonna use spaghetti we usually use uh, the fettuccine but it's easier for her she just kind of checks like a little bird and slurps it up um, and then the four cheese alfredo this is the one we absolutely love flavor and macro wise only three grams of fat one gram of protein and three carbs um, we've tried quite a few and they have not been as good as this one so if you haven't found one you like give this one a shot if you already like a different one cool use that everyone one. that one everyone yeah because we we cook this a lot for guests too um and they they're always in love with it i'm, I'm convinced it's the sauce it has to be <laughs> and they have oh yeah this is uh and lila's favorite four cheese also um this one's really good as well right now i have the water boiling once it's it, i get it to, well it's not boiling yet i have it to boil <laughs> once it starts boiling we'll throw in the pasta We're going to do a serving and a half for each of us and then um, just add an extra for Lila. So that means we need six ounces plus Lila. <laughs> All right, so now the water is boiling so I can put my pasta in it. Break it in half. See, does not fit. <laughs> Thank you. You want to try breaking it in half? Not the whole thing because it's hard. <laughs> Thank you. Put the seasoning. Okay, okay. <laughs> it's alright because it's water, it's gonna be dumped out. We're good. <laughs> There's no salt in that one, so it's okay. So, so you put that much? Yeah, yeah, you put that much. No, a little bit less. Thank you. We're gonna start cooking the chicken. That's about half a serving. Of butter. Of butter, yeah. My bad. <laughs> She's getting me distracted. This is what we're using. Oh, not the spoon. <laughs> We don't want to eat the spoon, baby. <laughs> She's like, uh, Yaya, because she calls herself Yaya. She can't say Lila, so she goes, Yaya, <laughs> for Chef Lila. Yeah, we got to get your gear on. Thank you. Thank you. It's like a hit and miss, man. <laughs> Good job. Since she's eager to do it, and we all saw what she did with the pasta, <laughs> I'm going to get it set up for her. <laughs> there you go. Sprinkle, no, on this one. Sprinkle it all around. Everywhere. Not just in one spot, but okay. <laughs> all right, here's a spoon. Mixy mix. Good job. Hey, bye. <laughs> Mommy. Ah. Just a quick disclaimer, um, Lila loves cooking. If you're new to my channel, you probably don't know this. You're probably worried like, oh my God, get the kid away from the oven. But Daddy, who's right like a foot away from us, and Mommy are always watching her. We never leave her here. She knows the importance of not touching anything. Um, so if you do it with your kids, make sure that you teach them not to touch anything and stay with them the entire time. Just a disclaimer. But she loves cooking. We're not going to deprive her. We're just going to watch her like a hawk. <laughs> she has apps. Huh? She has apps. Yeah, cooking apps. And she like makes a bunch of food. So, she loves it. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> My little wow wow. Alright, so pasta's done. Don't overcook it. If you overcook it, it's gonna get like soggy, yeah, mashy and gross, and it's gonna lose all its texture. Um, so keep an eye on it because the chicken's not done yet, but this is done. And don't leave it in the water because it'll still keep cooking. So take it out of the water. I'm gonna go ahead and throw in the green peppers and the red peppers because it takes a while for them to cook. I'm gonna go ahead and cover it a bit so it can steam the veggies and soften them a bit. When they're too crunchy, it kind of ruins the meal. All right, so the veggies are nice and soft. Uh, it smells really good. We're gonna add in the pasta, which doesn't really need to be cooked, just mixed around in there. <laughs> All right, we're doing four servings of the Alfredo sauce. Fair warning, it says seven. Serving size seven, it is not. There's barely any left in there, and that's only four servings. <laughs> I hate when they get things wrong like that. <laughs> it ain't creamy enough. I'm adding more. <laughs> Decide how much you want, how creamy you like it. He agreed. I'm like, what do you think? We both agreed. More creamy. <laughs> now we just divide it in half. We're not like super picky about what goes into what. We guesstimate. It's gonna be a pound. We're gonna get a pound heavier. Don't step on the scale after you eat. <laughs> Are you gonna pick out all of them that have red on them? You cray cray. Mommy. I'm still having my water. I know I keep saying I'm gonna get off of it, but it just makes it so much easier to drink water. <laughs> By the way, this meal, it is complete, but this is the first meal we ever made like ourselves that we were proud of. It was back in the beginning of our relationship and it was like, this is the bomb. It tastes so good. We made something that tastes good. Very simple. Very simple. I show you guys simple things because we like to keep it simple. We felt like grown-ups. I felt like, yeah, we felt like grown-ups at the time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm feeding her like a little birdie. I guess it was a mistake to mix hers with the green and red peppers because she has like, very little, but she's like, Mm, no, why is that there? So now I have to like clean each one off. You live, you learn. Parenting, I tell you. <laughs> Silly girl. Anyways guys, we're gonna end it here. If you like this recipe, if you want more Monday recipes, let us know in the comments below. We would really appreciate it. It keeps us motivated. As always, give the video a thumbs up. That also keeps us motivated. Um, if you're not subscribed, be sure to do so. Hit that bell for notifications. And until next time, bye guys. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>